Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Cupquake. We are going to continue Franbo. We just escaped the island with the sisters. And now we're with Mr. Midnight. Um, wow, what a tree. So what am I supposed to do? Oh dear, this bridge looks pretty scary. Oh, Fran, come on. We have to go home. There is no time to be afraid now. Yes, but I'm a bit afraid of heights. Um, I can go first, all right? Then you follow me. All right, kitty. You are so sweet. I'll be right behind you. There goes Mr. Midnight. Mr. Midnight. Look at him. He's so cute. Okay. Here I go. It sounds pretty dangerous. That's not a bridge. What happened, Mr. Midnight? Why did you stop? Fran, wait. What the heck? No! No! You broke my bridge! Why is there a demon after us? Oh, my dear, I can't hold it anymore. I don't want to die. You won't die, my friend. Come on, you can do it. Jump! All right, here I go. Oh, look at... I got you! He got me, Mr. Midnight! Oh, no, he doesn't! No! No! He jumped with me. He jumped with me, though. I mean, how how strong can a little kitty be? Don't be afraid, Fran. We always fall. And after the pain, we will always rise. <gasps> Is that the, is that our aunt? Aunt Grace? Oh dear Aunt Grace, don't ever leave me. Don't cry my little girl, your heart is pure but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please Aunt Grace, why won't you just take me out of here, please? You'll just leave me all alone like my mother and father did. Aw. I'm sorry, my dear Fran. You will soon understand. Aw. Aunt Grace, no! Don't go, please! Why does she cry? Oh, geez, that filled up pretty quickly. Who the heck? Oh, no! It's time for your new medication. No! The red pill. What really happened? I'm naked. I have no clothes on. Where are we? It's so pretty here. Oh, we're Mr. Midnight now. Oh, what happened? Where am I? Fran, where are you? Look at him. He's so cute. I'm playing as the kitty. Look at the little paw. What are Fran's shoes? These are Fran's stockings and her dress. And this tree has a face! What an ugly tree! I scratch you, evil thing! Kitty, Kitty, stop! What are you talking about? Oh my gosh, is that Fran? Oh, my darling, is that you? It can't be! What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Why else would I... Who else would I be? Fran, you're a tree! Don't be silly. Help me get up. Why is she a tree, guys? Just wait a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? I'm telling you, my dear, you've become a tree. What? But how? Oh, my dear, this was the end of the line. The big monster did this. I know it, kitty. He won't let us go home. I hope he won't come back. He's very scary. He always comes back. I think I remember him from that night. That night Mom and Dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you are... A tree, my friend! A tree! I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are. Am I gonna die, Kitty? Tell me. Please don't say that, Fran. Don't leave me. But I feel so weak. I'm a weak tree. There's tree people! Humka igni mi hala. Kulki ramahampa. Tree talk. This isn't a. It's a carrot, and this looks like an onion. Be careful, sir. What are you talking? Why are you attacking me? Could you please tell me where I am, sir? Hula hula. Stop it! I'll scratch you. 
Dracula rum igni. What are they saying? Oh my kitty, what is happening? Why is this happening to us? Hulwa! Hulwa! Stop attacking me! Is he Oh What is he doing? Find my person, please. Find my purse, please. Maybe uh, I can do something about this. Okay, so we need to find our purse. And I am Kitty. We need to go find the purse. Those are her stockings. Who is this little dude? Old vegetable sitting on a boat. Okay. What the heck? This took a turn. This took a weird turn. This is the purse. We gotta get to it. Um, why did she turn into a tree? Go, go, go. I have to reach it somehow. Okay, so how... Oh, I'll take this stone. It's shiny, and we'll put it over here. It's in my mouth. It's in my little kitty mouth. Uh, can I put, like... Use crystal with that. Use crystal in the cog. There we go. <laughs> he walks a little silly. Okay, let's grab it. I got the purse! Only because I'm the best! Look at how cute he looks with it in his mouth! Okay. I found your purse, Fran. I found it. That's amazing. You're the best, Mr. Midnight. Now show the sir who is attacking me my family picture. Maybe he'll understand what a human is. Okay. So let's use on this guy. Oh, he's taking her! Where are you taking me, Sir Vegetable? I'm going with you. They want to help you, Fran. I feel it. Don't be afraid, my friend. Okay. I'll be right here with you. We're going. We're going. We're flying. This boat flies. I seriously have no idea. Vegetable. Vegetative, vegetative state. Vegetative state. So I'm a vegetable. This is symbolizing me being a vegetable. Um, this is really pretty. Okay, so I, I can't read what they're saying at all. So we're just gonna click through this. Welcome, creature. My name is Ziar. Do you speak human? Oh my goodness, yes, finally. Words I understand. My good friend, Ride told me that you showed him an illustration with four humans and a cat. I assume you are one of them, the little girl. Please forgive my good friend if he scared you. We have never seen a human looking like a tree before. Help me! Please, I'm a girl! Oh, no need to speak, my child. The seed will show me everything. Okay, the seed. Where's the seed? Oh, this seed. Hmm. Oh! An, an apple? Am I an apple tree? Strawberry? We have strawberries around here. Ooh! So magical. Let me see. You're, you are good. No doubt about that. A seeker of truth. Very common of the bow family tree. Ah, your name is Fran. You are the little girl with a passion for life. I see great love towards this little creature standing next to you. A cat, protector of gates. Interesting. You can see all that... Why you can see all of that? Be quiet. I see something else. The seed doesn't hide anything. I see a world nobody should see. Nobody except for me. What do you mean? Except for one. You mean the monster? You are not supposed to be here, Fran. That is the only thing I can tell you, my child. Can you help me? We can't let you leave now. It's too dangerous for us. You should never have been aware of our existence. What? What? There must be a way. Am I dead or something? What do you mean by that? You know, when you no longer exist. It's not normal to be a tree. I must be dead. Death is nothing more than the absence of love. Aww. Once you can't feel love, you die. Even if your body still walks. Help me back home. I love my kitty, though. Little cat, come closer. Let me see you. What's your name? Mr. Midnight. 
That is indeed a very pretty name. Do you think Fran should go back home? Yes! I have a question. Are you a king? You're hilarious. Yes, I am the king. The king of Ithirsta. I thirst for some water. Um, what an honor. And by the way, I like your leaves. They're pretty. Please, will you help me? Um, why is the need of you going home so great? The sea told me your story. You don't have much to go back to. There are so many reasons. But the most important is my aunt. She'll, she will protect me. I want to feel that somebody cares about me. I feel confused all the time, and I want to be someplace I feel at home. You're very brave. Okay, I just want to go home. Please help me. Things I cannot do, but I will help you. I'll lead you to the door that will take you home, but it is your own task to walk through it. Okay. Well, talk about the door later. First things, you must be able to talk and walk on this land. Uh, I'm afraid I won't be able to bring your human body back. Only the Great Wizard! But we'll talk more about him after. You must first understand our language. Eat this fruit. You just hawked up a fruit. And I ate it. Your ears and tongue will be able to understand. But you're not your eyes. That means you won't be able to read. Okay. Don't worry about that. I can always ask. Excuse me. Do you understand what I am saying, human lady? Yes! Yay! Um... I demand one of your fruits myself. Or, demand? Kitty! Our land is based on fragrance and sound. You'll see everything as your own world very soon. No doubt about that, okay. Alright. Do you know why I became a tree? I don't think I'm the right one to give you the answers. Now it's time for the procedure! Are you afraid of heights? A little, yes. I get dizzy. Take her upstairs immediately. What the heck? Huh? Okay. It's a beetle. To get some arms and legs, everything will be fine. I'll be waiting for you, Fran. Love you. Can I have some sexy legs like that guy? Sexy. Top bag. What the heck is that? <gasps> Good day, my name is Palantras, and I'm your doctor today at your humble service. Are you the emergency case? Amazing, huge, beautiful, fluffy thing. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that I've never seen anything like you before. I'm still trying to understand that all of this is real. My name is Fran. I'm a human girl. The king sent me here to get arms and legs so I can go home. A human, I think I can get you a pair of arms and legs. But we'll have to travel a bit further in order to fix that. Are you ready to enter the paws of the beast? Let's do it! Oh, we're going inside of him. Oh, the, the paws of the beast. It kinda looks like one of those fish. Ooh, this is pretty. Ooh, dump me on in there. I'm taking a bath in a nice, Pink waterfall lake. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful and peaceful. I wish I could be here forever. Why don't you just stay here, Fran? Thank you. This is my home. This is where I was born. Aww. The spirit of the great Balokas created it. It was the purest water in the whole universe. Oh, wow. That sounds amazing. Uh, when do we start? We wait until the water purifies the curse. In the meantime, we can talk. All right. So who's Velokas? Haven't you heard about the five realities? He's the king of the first reality. A long time ago, he was at war with the darkness. And one day, he fell. He fell so badly, his heart was broken. He was alone. But he came to Ithirsta. Ithirsta! For water. I don't know why I keep saying that. And his blood made this water pink. That is why it's so pure. It's a very long story. That sounds grand. I mean, didn't I didn't know about other realities. And how about how is it that you are here? What brought you to Ithirsta? My kitty and I were on our way back home. I was so happy to see him and hug him again. But then we fell. The big monster that follows me did this. He broke the bridge. He wants me dead. 
Who would like to see you dead? That sounds terrible. I prefer not to talk about this. But sir, doctor, do you know where, why I became a tree? Yes, sometimes our wishes are so strong that they become true. You did this in order to keep yourself alive. Think about it this way. Your human body was destroyed, but you wanted to keep being Fran. You wanted to keep your life. So you took on this empty shell to maintain all of your precious memories of you. It is actually the first time I've seen a human using a tree as a crystal, chrysalis. But it's dangerous to have you here. It makes our land vulnerable. I did this to myself? Wow, but Palantras, sir, how did I, how didn't, I, how, I didn't know what I was doing anything. You really didn't know what you were doing. I see. Well, when you traveled to Aethersta, you opened a door between your reality and ours. And with this door open, and its perfect creatures can also enter our reality. And if that happens, the balance will be tainted. And there is only one who would like to poison the second reality. The monster, the terrible black. Oh, it's getting teary. Don't cry. I can't see this happening again. I just can't. Don't be sad, doctor. I'm very sorry for what I did. I didn't mean to. Oh, little girl, you're so nice and you don't have anything to be sorry for. I think you're very special and let's concentrate on your arms and legs, all right? Hmm. Yes, doctor. Soldier of the sun, spirit of the water. Give Bran her arms and legs. Tell me. Oh, look at the little tree girl! How do you feel, Fran, from Aethersta? Wow, I feel like a beautiful tree. I have leaves. I'm glad you like it. I told you we would fix it. The water is so magical. It can fix anything. Anything? Do you think it could fix my mommy and daddy? What do you mean, fix them? What's wrong with them? Nothing, doctor. Thank you very much for helping me. You're the best doctor I've ever had, and you are fluffy and beautiful. I wouldn't mind having a doctor like that. I had another doctor before. His name is Dr. Dune, but he was an evil old man. An old man. Hmm, I bet he wasn't that bad. Maybe he was just following the rules. Let's just, let's go now. I'll leave you at the station. I'm a little tree girl. So I reincarnated into a tree. Um, it's a pretty sweet little story. So Fran's body is gone. She's... Is dead. Here we are again. Shows you are the king. What a nice ether stain you've became. Thank you again, doctor. You have to meet my kitty someday. That would be lovely. I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Run away with your little tree legs. With your skinny little tree legs. Oh, love. You look. You loved my kitty. You fluffy kitty. Do you like that? Uh -huh. Here I am. Rad, my dear. You've got leaves on your head. How pretty. Why don't I just stay here? Let me see you. What a great ether stain you've become. Look at how cool that little throne looks. Thank you, sir, king, sir. The doctor is incredible. He made magic with the water. But he was sad. He told me many things, but I didn't quite understand. Don't worry, Pell on Trust will be fine. I know the reasons. We have some problems to solve, but that's nothing you should worry about. Let's talk about how you can get back home, right? Yes, please, you said something about a great wizard. Yes, the great wizard is the only one who is able to bring your body, your human body back. And he has the stones that can open the door that will lead you home. Where is the wizard? What stones? This land is full of things I don't understand. You haven't even gone outside this castle and you already want to know everything. That's the passion I was talking about. Have patience, Bran. The great wizard lives in the great mountain. Kutram. Kutram. But we haven't seen him for a while now. Find him and everything will be just fine. Why haven't you tried to find me the great find the great wizard yourself? Well, we don't need to. It's very logical. You see, we don't need a wizard to perform magic to prepare potions. We can do that ourselves. The wizard's most valuable task is to protect the stones that open the door. I see, so the stones are like keys. And where is this mountain you said? You'll have to ask around, follow the signs. I have to go now because I'm a king and I have a lot of king things to do. But I'll be back in time to help you with the door. Have a great thirst day. <laughs> and good luck finding the great wizard. And he just rides away on that magical creature. Cre creature. How did you... Wow, did you see that 
huge fluffy creature kitty? That's Palandras. He fixed me. Yes, it's certainly very fluffy. Oh, I forgot. Here's your purse. Yay! Thank you, kitty. Did you see my pills anywhere? I don't think so. Maybe they're on the other side of the lake, next to your clothes. Well, we have other things to do anyways. We have to find the wizard. We're off to see the wizard! Yes, the king said something about a mountain, too. Mountain Kotram. The great wizard lives there. Let's go. All right. Look at how pretty this throne is. I wonder if it's comfortable. Can we go up here? Can we just go explore? Oh, I just wanted to show Kitty. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, what was flying over there? There was something flying in. Just a guy on a boat flying around. <laughs> okay, let's, let's explore some flowers. And it's so pretty here. So now I have a little tree, a little tree hand. Okay. What about this guard? No, no, you can't get in. It's closed. What's behind the passage? Well, the library, of course, but it's closed. Come back in fall or winter. Winter. There are... Then it'll be open. Hey, aren't you the talking tree I took to see Palantras? That's me. I have arms and legs. Yes, and also a head. That's very... Positive. Why is the library closed? Well, that's logic. As the sun goes around the second moon of Ithers, that we open. Only then the real knowledge will be learned. And that only happens in fall and winter. Oh. So you don't learn anything while you're in summer or spring? Of course we learn. We learn all the time. I'm learning now that you like to ask many questions. I'm curious. That's why. I guess you're not from around here. Well, I hope to see you soon. All right, let's go. What's over here? A bit scary, but beautiful. Okay, let's go through the door. So magical. Look at the cool guards. Ooh, it sounds so pretty. Oh, I don't know how to read. I don't understand. Tree symbol, but I wonder what it says. We don't know how to read the language. Hello, sir. What are you doing? Just standing here, you see. Mount Kotrem. Kotrem. Yes. Where is it? Yes. Tell me, please. The mountain is only in the winter time. Winter time. What are you talking about? Of course, winter time. What do you think? Okay, we're just gonna go. See you later. Let's go down here. I'll find the mountain myself. Okay, can, I can't read the sign. Maybe there's a symbol. Oh, look at the fishes. Mountain, that way. Food. Let's go look. I like to explore. Um, A boat. And that's the island I was at. Here's where we were. And then this direction's the island. There's a big tree over there. I don't know what's over here, but let's go, uh, let's go explore. It's so cool, the little town! It's magical. Good day for good fabric and thread. A metro service. Wow, okay, so we're in a little town. Tiny shops. Can I talk to people? Hello, Fred. Oh, I'm Fred. I'm Pruter. I'm molding a piece of iron. Okay, we don't need to talk to everybody, right? Let's continue this way. I just want to show you guys the town. Look at all these cogs. Look, there's a, there's a worm. You have beautiful fruits. Would you like some? Mission to go home. All right. I'm a human. Maybe I shouldn't tell people I'm a human. Cool. All right. And there's a big old ant. Maybe that guy was from here too. Look at how cute she is. All right. So, ooh, who's this guy? Hello. Good day, young one. What is he? What are you doing? 
The war is about to start. I can see the meaning in the meaningless. What do you mean? Join me, young one! You'll be rewarded with a golden coin if you come back alive. Join you. Where? The game is about to get begin. You are Kamalas, I am something else. Black and white as the shadows and light. A board game! We're gonna play a game. Yes, a board game. Let's immerse in this adventure. You against me. I give you a coin if you win, eh? What do you say? What are the rules? Okay, we're gonna play and we're gonna make some money. First to place three at the same figure in a diagonal, horizontal, or vertical line wins. Okay. We toss some machinery to see who begins. It's tic-tac-toe. Okay. Why would you give me a gold coin if I win? I miss gold, and I'm very old. I've been around for a long time. I just want to have a good time. Well, okay, we're playing a game! He went first, so now it's my turn. Oh, I remember, isn't there like a way that you can play tic-tac-toe? What if I just put it like... I know that there's a way that you can play where you can always win. I don't remember exactly how it goes though, but I'm gonna try it. Let's... Wait, if I go... I seriously... Okay, I'm just gonna... We're just gonna see if I win here. It's gonna block me? Okay. Dang, yeah, this is stalemate. Nobody wins! Let's try this again. Me first. Me second. I'm blocking you and I win! Ha ha! I got a gold coin! Yeah! Okay, I think I know how to, I remember how to always win. Do we just keep playing or can I, I can leave wherever I want, whenever I want. Okay guys. Uh, I know that there's an achievement if you beat him a certain amount of time, so I'm gonna beat him a few more times, and then uh, we'll continue. But I'm gonna end the episode here. We're now a little tree in a magical land, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. The story is taking a turn, um, and it's getting super interesting. I think I'm dead, but we're gonna try to get my body back now. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Thank you so much for watching. My name's Cupquake, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Peace! Love!